Hello, my beautiful darling loves. Welcome to your love reading for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. I hope everyone is safe, happy, healthy, and doing well. For those of you new to the channel, my name is Gina. This is a Leo-only channel. Cross-watchers are welcome. Um, if you would like to view other sign placements, you could check out my main channel, Tarot of Light, and then I have a Cancer and Virgo-only channel also. Um, readings can be vice versa, so flip it, twist it, reverse it to whatever way fits you and your situation. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you know when my readings post. Um, if you would like to check out my tarot tutorial, the link is below. Uh, it's about two and a half hours long. I do have uh, personal readings open. You can book on my website. The link is below. And if you would like to check out my tarot and oracle decks, we currently have Spirit Shield Tarot and Oracle, buy one, get one free, okay? And then Royal Rose Tarot is 20% off. Um, so my loves, I, I noticed that on a lot of the readings, there's like this weird pitchy humming noise <coughs> noise in the back. I think I fixed it. Let me know in the comments if you guys still hear it. I don't think I hear it. I, I think I fixed it, but if you guys hear it, let me know, okay? All right, let's get popping and let's see here what we have for my little lion cub spirit. Tell me about Leo, please. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. Tell me about Leo in love. Okay, we have fantasy. We have shadow. And we've got friendly. So... Leo, I think that um, your person here is not sitting in the best energy. I'm not going to lie to you, okay? This is someone that they're in lust with you, not in love with you. This is someone that isn't exactly... Um, I wouldn't say they're keeping their options open because this person's not serious about the relationship. This is someone that, you know, um, has a lot of friends that with sex secret here... Um, this person could be bisexual, Leo, okay? Or this person could have certain kinks or whatever. This is someone that has a large friend group of people that they have sex with, okay? They have a large uh, friend group. So I feel like, Leo, this person is future faking, okay? They are future faking. This per It says here, I am obsessed with you, but it's sexual. I feed you a fantasy so I can get what I want, okay? This is someone um, that, you know, enjoys having casual sex, and that's fine just as long as you're having casual sex with other people that know that it is also casual sex, okay? In your case, Leo, maybe you weren't interested in that. Maybe you weren't interested in the whole casual sex vibe or friends with benefits vibe. So you made this person work a little bit harder um, to, you know, to get in your pants, okay? To get that good stuff, that goody goody, okay? So they're feeding you, you know, a, a fantasy here to get to, you know, to get to where they want to be, which is on a sexual level with you. But I feel that Leo, you know, the, it says dark night of the soul here. So I don't know why this person seems to be coming into a dark night of the soul. It says, you are making me face who I really am and I need time to focus on changing and healing. Leo, are you calling this person out on this? I don't know, you know. I don't know. All right, let's see here. Let's let's pull some cards. You know, because listen, guys, it's one thing if you want to have a, a casual sexual relationship with someone and the other person is on board and you guys both agree that you want to have, you know, uh, that you guys want to have that type of relationship. That's perfectly fine. Two thumbs up, right? Okay. But, you know, there's no need to go. If, if someone's not okay with that, Leo, you know, I feel like maybe you're not okay with it. And this person's kind of like just manipulating the situation. And you may tell that per this person, listen, that's not okay. You know, I came across as somebody who's looking for something more serious, uh, more committed, you know, I'm not looking for a situationship. I'm not looking for a casual, you know, friends with benefits type of thing. I'm looking for a relationship. You know, there's so many people out there 
that are willing to have casual, you know, relationships or situationships. Why would you go so far to hurt me when you can go out there and, and get it without hurting anybody's feelings? You see, and I think that's what you're telling this person, Leo, you know, why would you uh, do this in a way that hurts an individual when there's so many people out there that, you know, would are okay with that? Tell me about Leo, please. <coughs> Tell me about Leo. Oh my God, these cards are crazy today. Page of Pentacles and the Four of Swords in the reverse. <sighs> Tell me about Leo, please. Tell me about Leo. Three of Swords and the Knight of Swords. Leo. Tell me about Leo, please. The World card and the King of Wands and the ace of wands under the deck. So Leo, you know, here's the thing. Here's the, the shitty part about this, okay? Your person was kind of intrigued with you because you really made them put the work into getting you into bed with the knight of wands here, okay? You really, Freya, you really made them put the work into it. But here's what I'm getting. This person, you guys did the deed. They got out of bed and said, okay, I'll, I'll talk to you on a, whatever, you know, a good, a nice knowing you pat on the back, you know, like pat on the back. All right. I'll see you later. And I think that this person just dipped on you, knight of swords and the three of swords. And I feel like Leo, that was really wrong of this person. Um, you know, like it was maybe just a one night stand or it was just sexual. I, I feel like this is a little specific as to my Leos that really made it clear that they were looking for something serious. They made this person wait. They made this person put the work in. And I feel like Leo, they really did, you know, if for you to give it up, you must have felt like, okay, this is going somewhere, right? And I feel like with the world card and the king of wands here, Leo, you know, you're about to, um, teach this person a lesson. I feel like, I don't know if you're saying something to this person or if because this person used you and hurt you in this way, spirit is, ca you know, catapulting them into a dark night of the soul because what they're doing is not okay. You know, what they're doing is not okay. I mean, there's plenty of people out there that are okay with being friends and, and you know, sex with benefits. Uh, you don't have to give me anything. I don't have to give you anything, okay? You know, there's so many people out there that are, you know, on board with that. Why would you go after the person that, you know, is telling you, I don't want that for myself. I don't, I don't want to do that, you know? Why? Because you were a challenge. It was a little bit more, entertaining but you don't hurt people in that way you know you're making it clear that 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 is not okay with you and I feel like with the world card and the king of wands Leo you're gonna teach this person a lesson because I, I don't know if it's gonna be you particularly that's gonna uh, teach this person a lesson I don't know if you're gonna say or do something that changes this person or if it's just spirit getting involved saying listen enough is enough now you know tell me about the page of pentacles please and the Ten of Pentacles. Tell me about the Four of yeah, four of Swords in the Reverse and the Eight of Swords. So Leo, this person was promising you the sun, the moon, the stars, long-term commitment. And I feel like as soon as you're done having sex with this person, I mean, the minute that it ends, you feel their energy shift immediately. You feel their energy shift immediately. Three of Swords and the Page of Swords. It's almost immediate that you realize that, you know, that this person was playing you the whole time. The Hanged Man here and the Knight of Swords. You know, you were waiting for a Ten of Cups to happen here, Four of Wands. You were really starting to believe that this is the one. The hanged man talks about, you know, waiting, suffering, sacrificing to gain enlightenment. And I feel like Leo, this person jumped through all the hoops that you wanted them to jump through. This person waited and waited and waited. And then as soon as they got what they want, they put, they zipped up their pants and left. That's exactly what this person did. Tell me about the world card here for Leo and the two of wands. Tell me about the world card for Leo and the two of wands with the knight of wands. Leo, this person 
piss someone off. Eight of Cups and the Justice card. Leo, I don't know. God doesn't play about you, honey. Okay? God does not play about you. Leo, there is someone here that's angry. There is some, because you're here, Queen of Wands energy, right? And you're looking away from all of this. This player energy has a fight on their hands. This player energy is about to have a fight on their hands. They chose the wrong one, Leo. They chose the wrong one. The minute they zipped their pants up and walked away from you like that, karma said no. No, you, you picked the wrong, I don't know, you maybe have divine, divine protection, I don't know, but God is not playing about you, guys. Karma is not playing. As soon as this person walks away from you, um, they're going to be put through a dark night of the soul. Let's see here, tell me about this King of Wands. The Six of Cups and the Death card. Life as this person knows it is about to come to a total and complete end, Leo. They don't know why this is happening to them. They, they, they're going to be so confused as to why everything in their life is, is being catapulted, just thrown upside down. But that's because this person lies. They lie. I mean, there's so you, I mean, you have to understand here. Okay. It's like, it's like, okay, here's this crystal and I want this crystal, right? I want this crystal. It's here. I could grab it. I could get it for free. I, I can, you know, it's fine. The crystal's here. I can hold it. Right. But no, what I'm going to do is go punch that person in the face, you know, break their jaw and take their crystal out of their hand. Why? You know, it, it's like, why? I feel like that was like your main, your first thought after all of this. Why would you go through all of this? You know, making me believe that I loved you, future faking, making me believe this whole story, lying this whole time just to like zip your pants up and run. You know, I'm telling you, God does not plan about you, Leo, because as soon as this person walks out that door, that it's going to pop off for this person. Karma is not playing. All right, let's see here. Spirit, tell, now I'm not going to get my crystal back the way it was before. All right, let's see. Spirit, tell me about Leo, please. Tell me about Leo, please. We've got narcissist. We've got separation. And we've got distant future. Leo, spirit is telling you that your heart is going to heal. And you're going to realize that with separation and narcissist, this person was removed from your life because this is not, an, uh, this person is very, they're not good inside. They have a very narcissistic energy to them. And you are deserving of loyalty. You are deserving of love. Okay. You're not deserving of mystery and third party energies. You're not spirit is like, you know, you don't deserve this type of <clears throat> you know, evil in your life. Uh, that is not for you. Shoot, 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 shoo, you know? And because this person brought that level of pain into your life, they will pay for it because you were not, this heartbreak was never meant for you, Leo. The divine never intended this narcissist to be a part of your path. Spirit, tell me about Leo, please. Tell me about Leo, please. Two of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. I feel like, Leo, you're going to spend a lot of time wondering why it didn't work out with this person, if they'll ever be back to apologize. Because don't forget, Leo, the number one way to heal from this is to understand that the person that you're in love with isn't real. That, that person is not real. That is the first classic thing uh, of healing from a narcissist. The person that you fell in love with, that dream, that f dream of the future that you were in love with, it was never real. It was never real. In time, Leo, you will come to realize that the, be, this person leaving your life or being removed from your life was the best thing that could have happened to you, okay? Spirit, tell me about Leo, please. Five of Wands and the Joe. Oh, karma is pissed. 
the justice card in the reverse and the five of wands. Leo, this is nothing to mess with. This narcissist is about to get their ass handed to them by karma. Leo. This person may, with the Ace of Swords, the Three of Cups, and the Eight of Wands, this person may eventually, like, it may hit them that they're going through this because of all the people that they hurt in this way. So you may actually be one of the people that this person comes around to, to apologize. Okay. Um, you know, the, cause this life, the karma is not playing with this person. I'm telling you, I feel like by then you won't be interested in this person at all. You're not even going to respond to them. Tell me about the two of pentacles here for Leo and the knight of pentacles for a long time, Leo. For a long time, you held on to hope that this person would come back and do the right thing, okay? Um, you really held on to hope. Tell me about the Ten of Swords here and the Seven of Pentacles. I feel like you have a lot of nostalgia. You you think about it. everything that you're going through here. Um, it's it's you're you've been victimized by a narcissist and healing from that type of trauma takes a long time it does okay it does so you know you you held on to that dream that fantasy that they created the day will come though leo with the queen of swords that you won't care anymore and you'll realize with that six of wands energy that you're better off without this person tell me about the five of wands and the knight of wands Tell me about the justice card in the reverse and the five of pentacles. Leo, this person is losing money. People may be losing their health, losing their car. All the things that made them able to be this knight of wands in the reverse, their teeth. I'm getting something with someone's teeth where they're, they're needing to have teeth pulled or their teeth are rotting maybe or their teeth are turning yellow, um, the acne, just anything that made this person attractive. If they had a nice car, it's being taken. If they had a motorcycle, it's being taken. Um, if this person had a nice body, that's changing. Like whatever gave this person that zoom about them, that, that, that thing thing about them, right? It's being taken from them, Leo. And I feel like this is someone that's going to circle back around to not just you because they don't really know, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to sit here and tell you, oh, they know it's for what they did to you. No, this person did to a lot of people what they did to you. You were the last straw according to karma though. When, when they finally got to you is when God said, no, we're not, now you're going too far. Now you're touching things you shouldn't be touching. You know, Leo, I feel like by the time this person comes back around to you, though, you're not going to care. You're going to be over it. I think your message here, Leo, is to gain some type of closure so that you know that this person will pay for hurting you in this way. Because the question still remains in my mind, like, why would this person promise me all these things and do all these things when it couldn't have just been sexual. They couldn't have done and said all those things just for sex when sex is so easy, easy to get nowadays, you know? They wouldn't have really gone through all that work just to sleep with little old me, you know? But they did, Leo. They did. This person absolutely did. They put in all that work to make sure that they slept with you and hurt you because the hurting you part was payback for making them wait so long, okay? Well... All right, guys, I love you so much. That's what I got for you. But you're going to end up good here, Leo, okay? You're going to take your power back here. Self-esteem is high. Your head is up. You have freed yourself from, these, from this, and you have healed yourself, okay? I love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Take care, my loves.